All right. So this new game is coming out today, came out today called Eve Echoes, supposedly very similar to the Eve Online MMO. So I wanted to check this out to see what kind of game it is. And uh, yeah, just take a, take a deeper look at what this game has to offer and whether or not it's worth playing. CCP games, game restart required. Of course it is. All right, let's watch this cool video introduction one more time. New Eden. By the way, I know nothing about the game other than it's a space game where supposedly you can build and do whatever you want. You know, be a pirate, be a miner, be in a guild, do some, you know, guild wars or whatever. So let's let's take a look. I went on the Discord channel for for the game. Just it's the Eve Echoes Discord. Apparently anybody is welcome, so feel free to go in. Uh, looks like there's a nice discussion going on there. And uh, they said it's not pay to win. However, there are definitely microtransactions here. We'll see what's going on here. Man, it wants to access photos, media. Fine. Make sure you trust Eve Echoes. Of course. Of course I trust them. Please so uh, after about 50,000 attempts to sign in with my Google account, it didn't work for some reason. So uh, a bug, perhaps user error. But anyway, dear, new, dear pilots of New Eden, blah, blah, blah. It's finally launching. Fly safe. Godspeed. Very nice. Let's go ahead and click start and see where this leads us. Please confirm your race. Hmm. There is one God. Freedom and priceless. Order, loyalty, responsibilities. Let's take a look. More theor theocratic Please society. Your bloodline. Generally highly educated, religious. I guess uh, I'm gonna play for the Amar. Again, don't know any better. Let's go for this guy. He looks rich. We want to be rich. What are we gonna call ourselves? All right, it's working now. Things are not very intuitive. Let's call ourselves Navigator Zen. Yeah. Okay. Wonderful. Activating transneural brain scanner. Oh man, I'm getting the MRI just to play this game. Matched. Activating clone. Clone too. Man, it's like No Man's Sky. You know, everything is a simulated reality. Nothing is real. What kind of system requirements does this thing have? You have been diagnosed with a temporary autonomic dysfunction, a common side effect oh. of brain scans. It is recommended that you follow Article 366 of the Hitchhiker's Guide to New Eden, drink a can of Quaif, and relax your breathing pattern. Potted again? That's, what, ten times already? Seriously. By the way, forgive the uh, pixelated graphics here Eight, because actually. I don't know what's going this on. This is below the average for your batch of capsuleers. I have no idea what's going on Got with it. these Thanks. graphics. Did I know you before? Who are you? You have been diagnosed with partial memory loss. This occurs occasionally after the cloning process. I am your flight assistant, the second generation Creodrone Light Quantum AI. You can personalize my settings now. Oh, let's personalize. How are you feeling, pilot? Just another ordinary day. Do you think AI has... As AIs, we often dis... As AIs, we often discuss who the broker is. But... War tattoos originated in the Minmatar tribes. I like them... The existence of Vita. Just another ordinary day. Oh, the young male sounds way more old than the, sure. than the young girl voice here. Anyway, we'll go for the... You should read more ancient poetry. It is Shayla. good for your soul. Sure, Shayla. That's great. You can be my navigator. For the navigator. I've been cloned nine times. My body, my memories, my everything. Is it all even me still? It is sure that you are detached somewhat from your soul. Nevertheless, this does not affect your physical existence. Lovely.
Did I pay extra for the philosophy module? Sheesh. Forget I asked. Alert. An unidentified drone is closing in on your position from 3 o'clock. Your existence yeah. is threatened. Oh. A new target has been detected in what the... What is city. happening? Apparently we're getting attacked. The Sisters of Eve? Scanners are now showing a group of drones firing on an Astero SOE. Poor bastards. Caution. It is recommended that you activate the warp drive and pilot us away from this low-sex system ASAP. We're turning back and taking out those drones. Please confirm your command. Confirmed. Return now. Blast those drones what back dark to the ages? dark ages. You don't even know what age you live in. He's like, I've been cloned nine times. I don't even care if I die. Warning, enemy targets approaching. Okay, I can zoom out. Oh goodness, the camera is very sensitive. Prepare to lock target. Okay. Uh, uh. Oh, apparently I'm like turning. This will take a little getting used to. Tap the target in the bottom right corner to shoot. Pew pew! Am I shooting? Come on, not. What? Like, how do I move? Okay. Auto to orbit target function has been activated to shoot target, blah, 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 blah. Back to activate the repairer. I didn't know, I didn't even know I was damaged. So let's see, I'm attacking. Okay, so it looks like. So is the combat automatic then? And it, oh, should I should I just not touch it? Oh, all right. So it's doing everything for me. Wonderful. Your combat performance exceeding exceeded expectations. Of course it did. Honestly, the graphics look really trashy, and it's probably just my phone. Warning. The Astero is severely damaged. It is highly recommended that you abandon this rescue attempt and warp away for now. Stay the course. Severely damaged? They didn't even shoot at us. Started. Hull breach detected. Danger. Activating clone. Ah. I see. That's probably why we got cloned ten times. Because we're a reckless idiot. I thought I was a traitor, not a warrior. Welcome back. New body looks great. Let's hope it doesn't get wasted anytime soon. Alright. Let's get to work. 
You received a message from Concord 137 minutes ago. Congratulations, Capsuleer. You have completed your probation period. On behalf of the Directive Enforcement Department of Concord, I hereby grant you your plex. I got my pilot license? Are you serious? I'll be, yeah, is, is this, this for real, real after I got blasted? Yes! I got my license! I got my license! Ugh. Come on! Aren't you even a Very little happy, happy for, for me? It is my opinion that all life forms should pursue lives Don't of get quiet to have an reflection. Opinion, Shayla. <laughs> yes! New Eden! Here I come. I totally don't understand why we got blast uh why we got the license if even though we just got totally blasted into the oblivion. Uh, Susan says welcome. Dead project. Do you wanna take the beginner pilot training course? Oh, and it gives me rich rewards, then sure, I... Yeah. Combat, mining, manufacturing, trading, and transportation. You may also encounter anything. Deception, extortion, theft, robbery, shipped, destruction. Capsuleer, it's important to observe your surroundings. This is the only way you can discover hidden danger. I don't know how well I'm going to... Move in this 3D environment. Where am I? Oh, wow, it really zoomed me out to a point where I can't even see myself. You have mastered the basic basic controls. Something tells me that other phones should be this should be looking better, no? Perhaps not. You guys tell me in the in the comments. Okay, skills need to be improved. Dock to a station to ensure your safety. Okay, I'm going to tap on this eye. What is this? Things. You can use the overview to quickly locate various celestial objects within the system. Okay, outside require any, any action taken outside of the station require the view of the overview, use of the overview. Please follow the instructions for the next step. Okay. All station station space this interesting. So it just goes on by itself. Mission completed. Great. Docking successful. Not bad, Navigator Zane. Your tech level is critical. The higher your tech level, the more types of skill you can train, and the more advanced ships you can fly. Please follow the instructions. Give me those rich rewards already. Okay. Tap skills in the pop-up menu. Um, which pop-up menu? Scope. Do I click on my face? Uh -huh. Skills, I see. Yeah, please follow instructions. Okay. Click on level up. Man, I wish all the missions were this easy to complete in this game. I don't look so happy. I understand why. Okay, skills again.
Very good defense upgrade. Train level three. You're almost a qualified pilot. Now just wait 45 minutes until it upgrades. I see. So it just, you start it and it just keeps on going. Just like any other mobile game. Maxing out their skill training queue. How many, so how many can I have in my queue? Who knows? So firepower and armor. If any of you guys are interested in reading this faster or reading this slower than I do, please feel free to pause. I'm just skipping around. Don't want to keep this video. Don't want to, don't want to make this video too long. Inventory. What do we have here in the inventory? Impera. Not to be compared, not to be confused with the Emperor. Ship hanger. Actor. Hmm. Is it better? I don't even know. Your chance of survival will increase by 8.5%. Don't be complacent. Yes. Let's not be complacent. Hello? Hello? Can you hear me? Hello? I called you up to say hello. Important resources. Pirate ship. You're the only one who can help help us. Obi-Wan Zenobi, you are our only hope. Uh, travel by autopilot? Sure. Uh, sure. What do you think I'm supposed to do here? Can you pilot without the autopilot? So many unknowns in this game. That's where I heard. I heard that the learning curve is pretty steep. Tiny bit gets explained, everything else you just get to, you know, go read the encyclopedia for a few hours. Sure, yes, warp, prepare for warp. I don't even see my ship. Warp drive active. Oh, am I supposed to, am I zooming in? I see. Warping looks uh, like No Man's Sky, except not as pretty. Lock them. All right, and now what? Oh, good luck. Tap the weapon icon. Lower right corner to attack. They're cornering me. Activate my little repair drone thingy. What does this do? Combat seems fully automated. Okay, I got one of them. Afterburner. I don't even know what that does. Eight kilometers away too. I'm gonna turn this off because I don't even know what that does. Something penetrates, something glanced off. Targets have been destroyed, and I am uh, half destroyed here, it seems. A container is found. Open the overview. Tap on the container. And, uh, get loot. Okay. Station. Okay. Loot. Loot. Auto approaching. Okay, so I'm turning around, it seems.
Lutal. Great. Violent combat ability rating. Four. Please pilot to Pinnebecca 7. Sure, sure, please confirm. Autopilot engaged. Warp drive. I think it said active. jumps zero. Is there a different. Oh, wow. Uh, there seems to be a lot of things around here. Is that other players? Very nice. Arrived at Pima Becca. Pima Becca 10. I thought it was Pima Becca 7. How many Pima Beccas over here? Mission complete. It's funny, like they wanted me to help them, but then at the end of the day, I never even talked to these people. Oh, this is a miracle. I guess maybe I did. Your performance left us impressed. Of course it did, Susan. Of course it did. Fine. Fitting the correct weapon can greatly enhance the ship's power. Advanced weapon module detected. Follow the instructions. Okay, I think we're going to do this. And then uh, we'll stop right there just for the sake of time. So, like, that gives us a good idea of what, you know, what the game kind of feels like. All right, execution, you're good. So follow the instructions. All right, give me the instructions now. Good, okay, so I tap on the thing. All right, that's, that's all the weapon modules I have. No modules for this slot. Civilian small pulse, MK small. I, I wish I knew what the difference is. Let's take a look, I guess. You can follow the instructions to replace the slots and other pilot. You can only change that in the fitting station. Okay. You need to stay vigilant. Don't be too quick to trust strangers. Look at what we have prepared for you. Tap the character icon, click inventory again. Excellent performance. We decided to award you the level three pilot medal. How many levels are there? Probably like 70,000. So you think, oh, it's level three. I'm pretty cool. Really, it's like the first step out of 10,000. Ship one, executioner. Uh huh. Or what? Wing two. Item hanger. Item hanger. There. to executioner cargo hold. So what does it give me? You can try starting advanced tutorials and begin a new journey. Your beginner tutorials are complete, pilot. You have advanced, unlocked the advanced tutorials. You can find them under intelligent assistant advanced tutorials. I don't even know what intelligent assistant is. Why is it going to tell me? Of course it is. Oh, this is my intelligent. Yeah, okay. Looks like I found the uh, the graphics settings. Okay, if I go to settings down here and we'll go into graphics, let's go on super high. Increase the power draining on your device, cause it to heat up. Sure, sure. I just want to see what the system is capable of. And uh, yeah, let's go ahead and Move things a little bit, okay, and zoom in. Yeah, things look much better, as you can see, in high graphics than they were in low. So, yeah, so switching switching those settings is definitely going to help you get that game looking much crispier than, uh, than what I showed you in this video. All right, so I think I am going to start on these advanced tutorials in a little while. For now, this is, uh, we'll stop right here. This is Eve Echoes, the game that just got released today on iOS and Android mobile version. 
of the MMO um, looks like it's going to be in at least in many ways similar to the actual the actual online version, the actual MMO, because uh, yeah, it seems like the space is open. You can just kind of do whatever you want, advance yourself, uh, get the career plan, understand what to do. But uh, yeah, this is uh, this is the game so far. I don't really know what to make out of this game. I've never played Eve. You know, I you know compared to No Man's Sky, this is just a mobile game, so I don't know if I really like it. But I don't dislike it. It just it seems to be just another thing out there, and it is curious, definitely curious. And for those, it it does seem to be the type of game where you would need to spend a lot of time, but then the rewards could be really good as well. Um, yeah, let me know what you think in the comments if you would like. Let me know if there are additional tips or tricks you would like to suggest, obviously for a noob in this game like myself. But I wanted to give you these first impressions, let you know what this looks like. So we'll see you next time. Have a great day.